Hey YouTube, it's Mitch at iPhoneCaptain.com. Today we're going to be doing the top five free iOS 8 applications for the week. Today's November the 6th, so let's go ahead and get started. The first one we're going to be looking at is called Google News. So if you like to stay up to date on anything that's happening in the news, you know, maybe like technology or breaking news, you know, throughout the day, all you have to do is download Google News. It's free, and you can set it up so many different ways. When you get inside here, you see you got the top left corner up here. You first need to sign in with your Google username and password. And when you're in here, you see you can get the headlines. If you want to tap on that, it'll give you the weather, local weather, and the extended forecast, as well as top stories that's breaking throughout the world now if you want to set it up a little bit more personal you can choose di things from different categories here say technology so let's check technology and it automatically has different sites already installed on it like cnet pc magazine inquire time pc world and if you wanted to add a, something different you could just say add topic and say we wanted to find something about just just to see if it will actually do this jailbreaking and let's see what it pulls up and when we hit the return and you see now it pulls up lifehacker iDigital times forbes game politics master hurl so regardless of the topic you want you can just hit the plus icon hit add topic and it'll add it in there for you and then it will keep all of those uh, updated for you throughout the day and then if you want to customize or remove anything you can hit add and remove sections and so forth very awesome way to keep up with the news next one is a game called metal skies now it will take this application about two to four minutes to install when you first open it. It has to download a lot of stuff from the internet to work. So I'm gonna go ahead. I've already went through all of the tutorials and all that stuff. And it, just like any other game, you can buy extra coins if you want extra coins and all that kind of stuff. You see you've got a store down here at the bottom. You've got planes you can buy, bombs, you got a hangar where you can park your plane. And you see you even got a treasure there that's going to open in 43 hours, it looks like. But anyway, we're going to go with a campaign. And we're going to drive our own plane. And we're going to shoot. And you actually have to hold the device in your hand because you have to tilt it left and right, up and down. And then you have to tap the screen to shoot. So let's go ahead and get started. And you can shoot too much. It'll keep a little running tab up there above the enemy. And you better you get more damage with those with those big guns like this. See? Now we really messed him up that time. And I didn't mean to shoot that last bomb. I shot it on accident. And you see where we went for the win. Pretty awesome little game, guys. Definitely one you want to play. And it's called Metal Skies. Next one is called Run Sack Boy. This is from by Sony. So that should tell you right up front that they have really put a lot of money and effort into this game. And you have to run as this little sack boy here. And you just touch the screen to jump, swipe to, to run faster like so and we'll go ahead and show you how this works and I do apologize for that delay you hear and if you jump on the little spikes it will kill you so it's a pretty easy concept to grasp and it still let me level up, I don't know how. 
but you can buy different things in the shop and do all kinds of sorts. And you want to run from that guy, you swipe to run faster to get away from that guy to keep him from eating you. And I can't figure out what that's for. That's for something, but I don't know how to use it. You have to jump on top of your enemies and swipe to kill them. It tells you how to do all that in the tutorial. Next one is called Jet Run. This is a game also, and you have to fly this plane between all these different buildings here. This plays in the portrait position, and you'll see what I mean right here. You just tap to play, and you can swipe, swipe left and right to, to guide your plane. But you'll see you have to hit the little uh, shoot the little nukes or whatever you want to call them to get out of your way and then it'll it'll do the rest for you see I wrecked. That one there guys is pretty awesome called Jet Run. And the last one we're looking at is called Neato. And this is a widget and it will tell you how you can install this if you want to go through the tutorial. You can connect this to Evernote or Dropbox however you prefer. I've actually chosen Dropbox and it goes in your notification center and as you can see here I've got a couple widgets installed. I have the Bing app installed and it offers a widget for uh, image of the day uh, different trending stories fantastical is an awesome one but here's neato if you copy and paste a lot and I just simply put that in there just to show you how it works uh, if you want to tap clear it will clear it and then if you want it to go say to the internet over here and open up something on the internet and we'll copy and paste something here out quick just to see how it works and I'm going to just copy that now we're going to go into our widget over here and if I wanted to put that other somewhere else later on uh, I could paste that in here and then share it in Dropbox and then as you see I would have that to paste anywhere I would need to later on so it's a pretty awesome little tool to have, especially on your iPad, but it works good on the iPhone too. And uh, But it, the reason I say it'd be good on the iPad, it'd be good to have, you know, if you were doing a lot of typing and things like that. That's five free ones, guys. Let us know what you think. As always, don't forget, we do them every Thursday, top five free apps, and we do our top five free uh, top five tweaks of the week every Sunday. So that's some of our schedule. Keep that in mind and, and come back by and check us out those two days. But we do stuff daily. Be sure to hit that thumbs up before you leave. Share the video if you're not a subscriber. Hit that big subscribe button before you leave and keep coming back.